Uh, Richard cooked down with the sickness. I'm gonna have you gotta make a video using that now at some point. You ever heard that one? It's like the 30 style. Same oh, uh, style. They're seeing, uh, Richard uh, Cheese. Yeah, I, I heard that the first time when I was watching. What is it? Yeah, Dawn of the Dead. Dawn of the like, Dead. By the way, Monday Night Paintball is filmed on Monday morning, which is why I look out of sleep. And also why Jason rambled on and on and on. Has no idea what's going on half the time when Patrick's talking. It's not just a Monday thing. Don't let him fool you. Thanks, Patrick. <laughs> that needs to be the opening. <laughs> Uh, okay. <laughs>
on the, uh, the product page so you can see it working there. And if you wanted to rock it with open top look like so many of y'all do, you can take the flap, tuck it in, and use it that way as well. So uh, Fertig actually found out about this one by accident. How'd that go? Well, pretty much is we've been taking the photos for all the new AdPad products. I've been checking out and seeing what else we can fit into the pouches to make it uh, show you the most uses for each uh, for what each pouch is. That pouch actually, I've been using one in my loadout for a long time now, and I usually carry it with a, uh, a spare of 17 or 13 CI tank in the background in the back of it. Um, basically, that way, because my loadout has over 20 mags on it, which my 13 CI can't shoot fully, and it's always good to have a spare air tank. You can always reload out in the field. Um, so it's basically uh, been something I've used and I was just looking at it and went, uh, I wonder if this was the 30s and well, it did. <laughs> yeah, we got a lot of questions from you guys about um, what kind of pouch to use for the 30s. It being a pretty unique magazine, um, we weren't really sure what to say, but we're really glad that we stumbled upon the solution already in our catalog. So check it out. We got some uh, product photos up of it with the 30 round uh, mags to show you guys how it works. And as you guys can see, it's uh, ideal. I, you can really ask for a better pouch than that for those. Yeah, so when you guys are taking a look at the AdPad products, be sure to check out all the extra photos we've been putting up with it. They're showing the, the product with other uses on it, so it'll uh, allow you to get a better uh, scope of what we can, you can do with it. Awesome, and this is available in other colors too, right, for two? Yeah, it's available, available in every other color in our catalog currently, except for tan at this point in time. Cool. Yeah, so those of you rocking 30 round D mags, this is a pouch for you, and we would love to see some photos of it on your kit. And last up for you guys, we have Vipers Halo 2552 event going on April 12th through the 13th, and we are going to be there, right, for two? Yeah, we are. Um, I'm going to be heading down there. We'll be down there from the uh, Friday all the way through Sunday. Um, so basically from open to close. I'm actually, uh, I just got off the phone with Viper not that long ago. I'm going to be playing in the MAGFED portion of the game on Friday. So I'm really looking forward to that and seeing what uh, you paintballers out in Texas have to do with uh, an idiot from Ohio and California all rolled into one. We want to see what these MAGFED shooter games are all about. Because we're all about the MAGFED only games. Let's we'll see what the difference is. That yeah, should be a lot of fun. I'm looking forward to getting down there. We're going to have a full, uh, full store and... Uh, I think Patrick and I will probably do Monday Night Paintball from it next Monday before I pack it up and get on the road. Um, for those of you guys that have seen it, we've been posting up that we will uh, be bringing down product. Today is actually the last day to get an order in for us to bring it down to you. Um, so try, get your orders in today by midnight and we'll get them taken care of for you and taken down there. Um, if for some reason there's some kind of other circumstance, uh, please feel free to shoot me an email um, Monday night at rap4.com. And I'll see if I can uh, make some arrangements to get you guys taken care of. But uh, in the meantime, uh, get those orders in as soon as you can. We're going to have uh, a limited supply of 468s for sale with us down there and some uh, handguards and all kinds of other accessories, as well as a uh, full loadout of uh, everything we just got in an app pad that I'm still adding to the catalog as we speak. Awesome, dude. We got so much new stuff. And no better place to premiere it than at a Viper game. That guy has huge, awesome scenarios. So we're really excited about that. Yep, I'm excited to get down there. It's going to be a long road trip, 26 hours on the road just to get out there, and then 26 hours to get back. And we've got a couple other stops we're making in the middle. So. Speaking of MAGFED only games, our official team, ODSC, hosts one every month, and their next one is that same weekend. It's on April 13th. This is a MAGFED only game. Do not bring your hoppers. However, if you have a hopper fed gun, you want to see what MAGFED's all about, they have 10 free loaners they'll hand over to you. It's MKV with some DMAGs, it's a good setup. Get a good taste for MAGFED and see if it's right for you. The videos coming out of these things are intense. I get the pleasure of editing footage from everybody's helmet cam, they have a dedicated cameraman out there, and they have a dedicated photographer. The pictures and videos are awesome coming out of this thing. Don't miss it. If you're near Southern California or in the surrounding area, it's definitely worth the drive once a month to go get some MAGFED only play and see what all the hype is about. They're basically the fastest growing part of paintball we've ever seen. All right, Fertig, that's all I got. You got anything? Uh, no, that pretty much wraps up everything for today. Um, keep an eye on the catalog, guys. More AdPad stuff is going to be going up all week. I still got about another 100 boxes to sift through and uh, get all the different products separated out, and photoed and put online. I'll be annoying the hell out of Patrick, um, walking in and out of the office nonstop for the next two days. And uh, yeah, it should be a pretty good week. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Remember, Monday Night Paintball is your show. We make it from the content generated from our Facebook page. If there's anything you'd like to see next week's episode, just email us at mondaynight at rep4.com. Looking forward to hearing from you, and we'll see you out there. Yeah.